Welcome to DBR, where today we're looking at my old iPhone 5S. And what happened with this phone was it stopped working with wireless for some reason. And the only solution I found for it was to put the phone into DFU mode, or in other words, default firmware update mode, and then have iTunes reset because, of course, you can't reset an iPhone that's synced to iCloud until you turn off iCloud, and that requires an internet connection. I have it off service. There's no way I can access the internet without Wi-Fi. So it's pretty simple to figure out how to go into DFU mode, but if you have this particular issue, there was an extra step. So I thought I'd just take you through it and show you how you can get your iPhone back to working with wireless. So DFU mode, pretty easy. You turn your phone on, you have it plugged into your computer with iTunes on in the background, right? And then you hold the power button and the home key at the same time. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Release the power key, hold the home key until your iTunes says a device has been detected in DFU mode. Boom, there it goes. So iTunes has detected an iPhone in recovery mode. You must restore this iPhone before it can be used with iTunes. So you go OK. And then you got right here your option to restore the phone, restore and update. Now this process takes about, I don't know, 38 minutes to an hour. All right, and we'll come right back when this is finished and I'll let you know how long it took. Not quite done yet. Okay, it took about 45 minutes. And uh, now it says, you know, your phone is old and you want to set it up. And of course I do, so I'm going to unplug it from iTunes because I like to set it up from here. So for me, once I uh, connected it to my wireless again, right, you're setting it up from the beginning, yeah, just like before. So once I set it all up, the wireless still didn't work, um, and I just, you know, didn't update any settings here. It didn't work though, so what I ended up doing was, um, just kind of set up a temporary password here, who cares. Set it up as a new phone. Yep, 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 agree. Good lord, Apple. Let's just get to the phone. Booyah. Here we go. All right. So you go to settings, go to general, go to reset, and then erase all content and settings. That temp password you just created, you enter in, erase phone, erase phone, boom. And once I got it to reset from this point, Redid the setup again, just like I just did, and the wireless worked. This has corrected quite a few software issues with the iPhone 5, 5S, and actually even the 6, I believe. So DFU mode is a great way to do it if you're not concerned about the data. Of course, back up your phone if you are, and uh, make sure that you, <laughs> you know, have everything that's really pertinent to life saved on something else. And, uh, you know, you can use iTunes for that. But there you go. There's a reset in DFU mode to solve an issue I had with wireless not connecting with my iPhone. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And see you next time on DBR. Now, back to Attack on Titan.